Hello everyone, this is Magical Witch and I am here to show you guys this awesome spell that you guys can do at home. This is a come back to me spell. Now, what you're going to need for this spell is a glass. This is like a vase, make sure, or you can use a jar, an open jar, big enough, like this size if you want. Um or a vase with water. You're gonna need a red candle. You're going to need a fresh red rose. You're going to need a instant comb, okay? Make sure it's either lavender or you can use rose, but most, most likely rose, okay? Rose incense, but a cone, all right? You're gonna need a wooden stick to write on the candle. You're going to need a lemon. And you're going to need also a perfume, your favorite perfume, okay? A perfume that you know that your ex always smelled you. <laughs> um, a favorite perfume that you have, okay? Um, or that you used to use when you was in a relationship with that person, okay? Now, what you're going to need, I mean, what you're going to do is you're going to take a normal shower, okay? A normal shower. And don't forget, guys, matches, please, okay? All right. What you're going to, let me just clear this out a little bit. Okay. What you're going to do is you're going to take a normal, normal shower, okay? Head to toe, wash your hair with regular shampoo, conditioner, soap. You need to take a whole shower, okay? After you take your shower, you rinse off the soap, everything is good. You are going to take your rose. Now, you are going to take the petals, okay, of your fresh rose. Open it up. This is just for one rose, okay? <laughs> okay. And you are going to spray three times your perfume, all right? Three times. One, two, and three, okay? And after you do that, you are going to take your petals, all right? And you are going to pass it all over your body from toe all from your feet all the way up to your head so you're going to be passing it okay passing the roses all over all over your body all over your body from your toes all the way up to your head okay after you do that you are going to take this and you are going to and as you're doing this, you are asking Mother Universe or you're asking the Goddess of Love to bring this person back to you, okay? One fell in the water already. <laughs> bring this person back to you. You're going to be saying the person's name and you're going to say Mother Universe, Goddess of Love, bring John Doe to me, bring him back to me. And whatever you want is your intentions, okay? And after you do that, you are going to place the petals inside of the water, okay? Inside of your water. Now, you are going to take your lemon and you're going to do the same thing. You are going to pass it all around from your toes all the way up, saying the same thing. Mother Universe, Goddess of Love, my angel, my guardian angel, bring this person and you're going to say that person's name to me, okay? And after you put all your intentions, all your energy into this, that you're passing it all over your body, you are going to say three our father prayer, three our father prayer, okay? After you do that, you can say our father who are in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Everybody says it's different, but what? whatever our fathers you know our father who are in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread forgive those who trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us 
lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. You're going to be saying it three times. After you do the three prayers, you are going to place this inside of your water, like so, okay? Inside of your water, like so, okay? Now, you're going to set this to the side. You are going to now turn on, all right? You are going to turn on your cone, Okay, you're going to turn on your cone. And you're going to place it. There we go. And you're going to place it right next to the water. And you're going to take your candle and from the head to the bottom, you are going to now put the person's name. So I'm going to put John Doe and their date of birth. 1681, let's say. Okay. You're going to write their full name and their date of birth. Okay. Then you're going to take your perfume and you're going to spray it three times. Now, you have options. You can just use your perfume, but if you have a love oil, um, you can anoint the love oil and then spray the your perfume in the candle. But if you don't have the oil, just with the perfume, you're fine. So you're going to first, one, two, three, on the name, and then you're gonna go one, two, three, one, two, three, all over the candle, okay? Then you're going to take this, you're going to turn it on. Okay. And now you are going to simply keep it right next to the jar. Let me just, hold on. Here we go. You're gonna leave it right next to the jar. Okay. And you are going to have the cone going, the jar right here, the candle here, and you're going to simply visualize this person coming back to you. And you're going to say his name three times, John Doe, John Doe, John Doe. You will come back to me. So mo it be. And you're gonna stay here, visualizing that person coming back, for like a minute, okay? And then after you do that, you're gonna wait until the candle burns all the way down. Once the candle burns down, that's for say, okay? Once the candle burned down, the incense already finished, okay? You are going to take this, you are going to open the front door, okay? You're going to open your front door. Now, if you live in an apartment, then you're going to have to, <laughs> then I don't think this, I, I'm going to be honest with you. If you live out, if you have a house and you can open your front door and it's outside, then that's good. But if you don't, then I don't think you should do this spell. Okay. Because this, after the candle burns down, you're going to simply open your front door and you're going to take this and you're going to dump it out with the water, the not the, not the glass, but all the water, the rose, and the lemon, and you're just gonna go like this, okay? Throw it out, because you want that person to come 
to come to your door to come to you, okay? So you got to open the front door and easily go, okay? Throw it out and then you close your door, all right? But when you're throwing it out, you're going to say the last thing, John Doe, John Doe, John Doe, come back to me. And you're going to, then that's when you're going to, and throw it out, okay? And then simply close your door. Um... So if you don't have a, if, if, if you live in an apartment and you can't throw it up because of the hallway or whatever, then don't do this. But this is not the spell for you to do. I have plenty of spells on my channel that you guys can try. But those of you who live, ha have a house and live and you can just simply open your door and it's right outside of your door and outside is outside, <laughs> then you can do this. No, you cannot throw this out the window. No, you cannot do that. Okay. This has to be in your front door, open it up and in the middle of the night and just throw it out, okay? I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. Those of you who are interested in any of my spells, you can reach me at magicalwitch777 at gmail.com. That is magicalwitch777 at gmail.com. Blessed be everybody. I love you guys and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.